cuánto al prestarte get to day five in Aruba so our trip is coming to the end um, it is day five unfortunately and which makes tomorrow day six and um, the day we actually leave is day seven so yeah but um, it's very very bright out here I just wanted to show you guys my face for a second because I feel like y'all seen me just in my sunglasses and that's about it so hey okay bright now I'm gonna put my sun put my shades on because it's too bright alrighty um so I am just walking along the beach um I showed you guys the beach a bunch of different times but it is just so beautiful I'm just gonna show you guys again I'm just turning around so beautiful out here. Um, 
the water is usually pretty warm. Sometimes on some windier mornings, it's a little cold. But by like 12, it, the ocean water definitely warms up. Um, so yeah, it just looks so, so, so gorgeous out here. So pretty. Ladies, welcome. So, you know, we already, I think we got enough potential thumbnails. Um, but really, I just wanted to tell you guys kind of what today would be like, just in case I don't get to tell you when um, it actually happens. So, yesterday was Father's Day. We went out to dinner at Papillon, a French restaurant. Papillon is French for butterfly. Papillon, sorry, Papillon. French for butterfly. Um, it was amazing there. I think that was the best food that I've had so far. Um, I've had some pretty good food, so that says a lot. Um, and then today is make your own pasta night, so um, I cannot wait for that. That's going to be amazing. And um, so everybody slept in today, uh, per my father's request to like sleep in and not get up early and just start doing a bunch of random things. But we all slept in, um, by like 9.30 my alarm went off and I was like, alright, I'm good, like, I'm good, I'm, you know, awake. I pretty much went to sleep at like 12 last night, so that's a good full 8 hours. Um, but anyway, today we will be doing the water sports that I kept telling you guys about. So it's like the canoeing, parasailing, kayaking, um, jet skis, um, and then probably towards the end of those activities, we'll get like the little tubes and just like chill out in the ocean with the tube rentals or at the pool with the tube rentals, something like that. But yes, today is water sport day. Um, I have to see what time the spa closed because we have $75 off at the spa. And I'm wondering, should I use it tomorrow or should I use it today? Like use some of it tomorrow or use some of it or today. So I, can sh I definitely want to show you guys the spa and like me getting a massage and, and everything like that. Um, so yeah. Um, but I think that's pretty much like it. Um, I don't know if I ended up after the sailing and snorkeling, we were very tired, but we kind of just chilled out at the resort, um, and then we got dressed and then went out and ate food and came back, and most of us kind of just went to sleep and all that stuff, so yeah, that's pretty much how that was. So today, we'll do the water sports. Um, I know the water sports end at like 4.30, and then we'll probably, um, just go on with the day um you know keep chilling at the resort beach you know whatever because honestly like look like the resort is right here like that's the resort this is the beach that's why we're able to like chill at the beach or beach and resort or do the water sports and then chill at the resort. like we don't have to go far and that's what i really wanted for um this whole all-inclusive thing because some of these hotels like they were all inclusive but the beach was like across the street like even the beach is like across the street nobody wants to cross the street they just want to hop on the beach that's that's doing too much so yeah sorry i just woke up so you know waking up stuff but i'm about to go into breakfast breakfast was crazy yesterday because it was father's day and everybody wanted an omelet handmade so I didn't get an omelet handmade, but I got some French toast. Had some bacon and some scrambled egg. But today, today, I will get my omelet. Um, their French toast is so good, so I just eat it all the time. I mean, I had waffles one day, but their French toast slaps. So, I'm going to head in there right now. Get some French toast and handmade omelet, and I'll see you guys later.
Hey y'all. So, it is my going back day. That's what I'm going to call it. My going back day. Because yesterday was my last day. Today's the day we are leaving. Um, and I just, I wanted to explain why I didn't vlog yesterday. So yesterday, I did not vlog at all. Because it was our last day. And we just really did the beach and pool resort type of thing we just chilled out nothing was really um worth vlogging that you haven't seen already so that was like one thing and two um my dad and my brother went parasailing but i don't parasail so i couldn't be there to even get a clip of that or anything like that so that's another thing and we were just um we are just all very tired by the end of the trip because we did so much. So yesterday was really like, wake up late, eat breakfast late, come to the beach in the pool late. I mean, my, me and my mom did a little last minute shopping. I got this crew neck type thing so I can wear today to the airport so I can be, you know, warm but not overly heated while still being here for the last 30 minutes, I think, almost, because we um, our bus leaves at 10.45 to get to the airport. And our flight leaves, like, way in the afternoon. We have to be there three hours early to do all this airport stuff. So, hopefully, I'll be able to get to show you guys some of the things. Um, but I don't know if I'll be able to film the customs part. Like, it's really hard to film that part. Um, I might get away with it on my phone, but I don't know with just having a whole professional camera out. But anyway, all in all, I just wanted to say this resort in total was gorgeous. I had a great time. Um, shout out to all the people that made videos about Holiday Inn in Aruba because it really helped me figure out which hotel I wanted to help my family book. So this was just nice, and I just wanted to show you guys the water in the morning time I mean it stays like this consistently but the water the beach again, like just look how gorgeous my background is like my view for the last uh, what was it eight days eight days seven nights was just beautiful it was so breathtaking some of the things we did like the boat ride just so breathtaking and just so fun overall we had a really good time this is a really laid-back resort even though they have like parties um, they have carnival nights they have parties and then they also have some restaurants next door that have like parties and stuff but this is my final goodbye from the Holiday Inn Resort Aruba um, and yeah so I am now going to walk to the front of the hotel and from here on now most of the video clips after this will just be clips of me leaving so i will say goodbye to you guys thanks for watching do not forget to like comment and subscribe um on each part of the video i told you guys there will be three parts so please do not forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel um see more content like this so i will see you guys in my next video bye yes.
Thank you.